Hello friends, welcome back to Supergery 7. Today I'm going to share with you car tuning details which I'm going to use in WTC 700 championship. As you already know, the car which I'm going to use is Mercedes AMG. Uh, but before beginning, please like my video, share and subscribe my channel. This will motivate me to keep continuing my work. As you know, the championship consists of more than one races. Uh, and between those races when you start the championship you cannot change your car during the championship when it's going on so you have to select the car and make it tuning perfect or near to perfect which can meet all the racetrack requirements because all the racetracks are not the same so you have to select the car and tune it in a way that uh, can perform very well in all those tracks so I tried uh, with many cars like Ferrari, Toyota Supra, Nissan GTR, tuning them with modification and demodification, but those didn't perform in one of them or racetracks. But this was the car who performed very well in all these three racetracks. So I suggest you if you are looking for any car for this WTC 700 championship. So please go ahead for this uh, Mercedes AMG and after a short while I will share with you tuning and some, I have done some demodification all those details I am going to share with you so please stay tuned. The purpose of sharing this video at the beginning is uh, I wanted to share with you uh, the result of uh, the modification which I have carried out as you can see how well this car performs especially the handling around the corners and this is all because uh, some of the demodifications i have lowered down the pp to uh, make to meet the criteria for this championship but also to make sure the car performs and handles very well in all the three race tracks because uh, if you perform well in first race track it doesn't mean it is not necessary that you will also perform your car will handle well in other racetracks as well so this was the reason I took it took too long for me to upload this video because I was uh, searching for the best car who can perform in all three races so this is this was the one uh, it, I selected and who meets the maximum criteria for this race for this championship in order to win uh, by securing first place and with a clean race bonus just stay tuned and you will see the results the car which I was recommended for this championship was Lamborghini I don't exactly remember which uh, model it was uh, I was recommended by cafe book menu there you have uh, an option to check which car they recommend for each and every specific race championship but the thing was i didn't own that car i didn't have it in my garage and i don't prefer to buy any car unless i win as a reward in championship or uh, any races so i prefer to go with any car which i had in my garage already so this was the car i found it to be best for this championship and you will see the results if you stay tuned till end of this video
so here it comes the important part of this video so first of all you will go to car settings and head towards the detailed settings I have made a separate page for this uh, WTC 700 championship and I bought racing hard tires for this race suspension I have kept normal and all these settings are by default you cannot change these settings differential is normal as well downforce for rear end I have selected 308 and front you cannot change it's by default and full control ECU and output adjustment I have made it to 81 don't go for max so this settings these settings will uh, help you in this championship or our championship so you will not going to change you will not need to change uh, these settings for each and every race I bought ballast and installed 5 kg and positioning is positive 14 power restrictor is by default and transmission is the normal one turbocharger I'm going to use high rpm I do had a racing intercooler but I demodified it to the normal one also the air cleaner and muffler as well these settings help me out over all this championship Here it comes the race 2 of WTC 700 championship. As you can see my competitors are uh, some of the best cars of Gran Turismo 7 like Ferrari, Supra, Corvette but all depends on the tuning process how you tune your car, tune up, tune down it really matters a lot as you, you can see the results as well A slight touch with the car which I didn't mean to do that actually it was from uh, my behind so it was not my fault actually but I don't know I'll be qualified for clean race bonus or not I'm sorry dude Here I am at the uh, 8th position and let's hunt down all the remaining cars in front of me.
guys i hope you like this video you like this content please do like this video and subscribe my channel I'm using DualSense controller for the races. As you may observe, the jerks while turning around. I'm about to hunt down Toyota Supra and secure first place. The distance between first and second position is around two seconds and this is the final lap. The race is going to an end. Most probably I will secure this position. And yes, there we go. So first two races I got first place. And now here comes a tricky racetrack, Nurburgring. Actually I was not able to record while I was uh, driving. So I recorded the replay. And here it is for you. So I'm sure I will not get clean response in this race. It's because the first turn consists of uh, collision with other cars. I think this uh, replay menus are also looking cool. So just bear with me till end of this video. And let's see what position I secure in this race. Nurburg Range. This track has a lot of turns. It's difficult to remember all the turns unless you play on this track continuously. This is I think the toughest track in Gran Turismo 7 and in real life as well.
is almost half of the race is completed and I'm still at 11th position but it doesn't matter half race is still remaining and I'll try my best to cut the grass The race is going to an end and I'm still at 4th position and I'm hopeful that I will acquire 1st position. Let's see, let's see till the race completes. I failed to secure 1st place, no problem. But the at the points table, I'm still at uh, first place because I secured first position at first two races. And as per the points table, I'm still at first. Thank you very much, friends, for watching this video.